Josh back for Castown. What do you think? I, I think it's a little warmer out there this morning than it has yeah, been the there last you go. few. You're, you're on top of it. Very yeah. astute. Yeah. Yeah, you're on. That's why she's a queen. Queens are astute. Yes, they are. We were talking about football, so she wasn't listening. So that's yeah. why, that's no. why I was just wondering. I was on Facebook. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Quite honestly. Uh, you were scrolling social media. Is Facebook still a thing? Yeah. It sure is. Is it really? I don't know. It sure is. Wait, I couldn't tell you. Uh, good to see you folks. I think you're going to like how it feels out there right now. It's not that bad. Our temps are in the mid 30s. Bangor's 34 and Bar Harbor's 34 and Augusta's 35 above freezing for the first time in days. Portland is 31 and Lewiston's a little chillier along with Wiscasset in the upper 20s. Now these temperatures unfortunately aren't going to rise a whole lot more from where they are right now. We've got a front coming through and that'll stop them in their tracks, mostly in the upper 30s for highs. And then we'll chill off back into the 20s tonight so that when this arrives, which is mostly rain out here, it'll be in the frozen form for us. That means some snow all light with minor accumulation, but still some snow later on tonight and tomorrow. Pretty quiet out there this morning. Clouds with a couple of breaks. It's not frigid for a change. Midday, we've got clouds to the south and sunshine up north, feeling pretty mild, and it'll be similar later this afternoon and evening. No precipitation, though, so your commute home will also be pretty smooth, too, and I expect snow to soften up and maybe even get a little slushy in spots as we roll through the day. Here are your highs. Bangor gets to 35 with Bar Harbor, so again, we're only getting another couple of degrees here. Lewiston 36, Wiscasset 37, Portland 38, Mountains and North not too bad either. We've got a few systems that will be passing through over the second half of the week. The one tonight is snow. There's going to be another one tomorrow night. That'll be freezing drizzle or rain over the interior and some plain rain along the coastline. And then a third one on Friday is more rain for the coastline, but snow for the mountains in north so that the snow up north into the mountains should maintain itself. And we probably don't lose much during this somewhat mild stretch. Saturday will be beautiful, easily the pick of the weekend with sunshine and a high near 40. Great outdoor fun activity kind of weather. Sunday is getting a little more interesting. We could be dealing with a storm on Sunday, a larger one than these little weak things that will be passing over the next few days. This could be more of a nor'easter type system here Sunday with rain and snow and maybe some wind in there too. We're keeping a close eye on it because it's just kind of popped into the forecast on Sunday. Late tonight around midnight and early tomorrow morning, we'll be dealing with some snow showers and bursts of light snow. It's not very uniform. It's not going to be banding. We're not going to have one inch per hour rates or anything, but tomorrow morning's commute could be a little slippery in spots as roads get a little greasy. It tapers off tomorrow afternoon. The second round comes through tomorrow night and at the surface over the interior. Look at this 29, 29, 27, 29 below freezing while aloft it supports rain. So that's a recipe for some ice, some freezing rain or freezing drizzle, especially away from the coastline where our temperatures are probably going to stay above freezing. That means Thursday morning could be slick. There could be some glazes on some surface surfaces over the interior. Roadways may need some treatments too. snowfall tonight. Tomorrow, not a lot inch or two down here, maybe a third over in the lakes or mountains of New Hampshire, but it looks like just an inch or less for Bangor and just some flurries up north. So more of a nuisance than a big problem tomorrow morning. Small crafts, seas three to five, northwest wind 10 to 20. Partly sunny, quiet all day long, highs in the mid to upper 30s. Tonight we start to see some light snow and that continues tomorrow morning before tapering as drizzle tomorrow afternoon and highs between 30 and 35. Tomorrow night some icing is possible, so Thursday morning looks pretty slippery away from the coast. Friday we've got rain for the coast with some mountain and north country snow. Saturday looks beautiful. Sunday may not be, and it's not a guarantee we get this storm. It's just the fact that it looks like a larger, more powerful storm than what we're going to see these next few days. Ooh, okay, right, well, stay yeah. tuned. Stay Something tuned. Keep your eyes you on go. Mr. G. Yes. Sorry we have you. All right. <laughs>